Hey guys, good afternoon here, good evening, how you doing? So it's been a while since I made a YouTube video and I just wanted to make a YouTube video to catch up on what's been going on lately. Um, so I got some big news, so stay tuned and um, yeah, let's get going. So first things first, big announcement, I've been really busy coding, making website. It's not Shopify, but it is pretty cool and it can be used for Shopify and other things. It's called Linky App. And what Linky App is, it's a, what exactly what it sounds like. So comment below what do you think Linky App is, like right now, before I tell you. Um, besides that, I haven't made any Shopify related video because, well, I just don't know like what kind of video I should make. Anyways, back to Linky App, if you commented below, <laughs> You think it is, but it's a it's it's a it's a link directory app, and um, what it does is it, it's a list of buttons basically. There's like there's like a at the top there's like a uh, at the top there's like a photo. Actually no, at the very top there's a name, and then right below that there's a photo, and then right below that is a bunch of links, and that's exactly what it is. Um, with the customization, I made it so that there's so many different customizations. Like, you could customize the buttons, the colors, the fonts, and all sorts of cool stuff. Really interesting. I use Angular, and uh, Angular is, um, well, Angular is Angular. I use Angular 7 and Angular 8 to code it. And one of the challenges I wanted to talk about when I was making this video, well, making this app, Linky app, was uh, actually getting the stats and the stats. So there's like the stats, and it's not completely solved yet. Um, like the analytics, whenever somebody would click on something, I made it so that um, you could see the click and um, where it's from and all that. But just making the graph, that was the first challenge I faced, making the graph look all nice and stuff. And it's still not perfect, but of any means, but there is one graph I use uh, the, I think it was like the Google Google Charts API to make the graph. Um, pretty interesting stuff. The second challenge I faced was uh, SSR, which is uh, SSR is um, it's a abbreviation for server side rendering. And with this app, it what it does is the server makes a page. Like it makes a page and then sends it to the browser. Usually an Angular app, just a bare bones Angular app, would be running on the browser. So a lot of the logic, a lot of the uh, computer work is done directly on the computer. Um, but with SSR, um, the computer work, the, the configuring and all sorts of stuff is done in the server. And then the results are sent to the browser. And with this app, I actually learned a whole lot of new stuff about Webpack uh, and uh, Webpack's and Webpack Webpack <laughs> uh, Webpack technology, which is uh, just uh, another library for like putting things together, boxes inside of boxes. That's what the logo looks like anyway. Boxes inside of boxes. Um, Webpack is required for SSR, and I think it's Express. I believe Express. Um, and what, it, and I was also use my stack. What was my stack? It was Firebase, Angular, Webpack, Express, and uh, for the graph. For the graph, uh, I think it was like Google Charts. So that's that's the stack that I'm using right now. Um, and I'm really happy with uh, with how much I learned during the journey and uh that's really what i've been up to for the last um the last month or so and uh i haven't really been making videos because of that because of that but now that the project is kind of going kind of working you can go check it out the link is below and by the way from now on i'll only have one link below because i'll be using linky app below and have a bunch of other links within linky app so therefore i would only need one link to share and that's exactly what Linky App is for. It's for only having to share one link. So, like for example, for this video, it'll have its own link. 
and I could create a bunch of different pages um, or I could have one link for for my bio but there's a bunch of different fonts a bunch of different styles and gradients and colors the buttons are all the same size the image can be changed but um, the only images that can be changed is a profile image so that's that my hands are getting tired guys I hope you enjoy seeing me again I have I know I haven't shaved in a long time oh well um, yeah thanks for subscribing by the way I really appreciate every single one of you guys that subscribe to watch my videos and um, and have a nice day see ya bye 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 okay <laughs> happy fourth of July <laughs>